And that's a sample of the Your Day Will Come by the Dwellers. What do you guys think of that? Sheridan, go ahead, because I heard the whole track. That that I thought was really dope. Um, it reminded me of like earlier uh, Uno the Activist, um, but like much more polished, like better than Uno the Activist. I like Uno the Activist, but he's very like underground sounding. That that sounded um, like lyrically much uh, much better than he, Uno the Activist would have been, and I thought that. Um, the beginning part started a little slow. I was like, I don't know about this. But then once they actually started like singing, I was like, this is sweet. Yeah, once they get into their melodic vibe and really start yeah. doing what they do, it's a really interesting track. I do think that they have a habit of sometimes coming in a little bit slower and it can take you a second, kind of like you said. But this track, I, like it's a bop. And like from top yeah. to bottom, I like this track. Um, yeah, they, they I a really can tell. Good job. This is, yeah. I think it's the first track of the year. Yeah, I can tell I would go back, like, if I listened to it the full, like, length of it, I would actually appreciate that beginning part. It was just because I didn't know where they were going to go with it that I was like, huh, what is this? Absolutely. I mean, it's what I like, I've, I love The Dwellers. I mean, I don't know if you know too much about them. It's a two-person group, Lil Shabby and Yellow Boy. Lil Shabby normally hits most of the melodies. Yellow Boy normally hits most of the bars. But they both do everything. You feel me? Yeah. Um, easily uh, one of the most viewed and popular groups in this area. Uh, they got tracks for like 500k. Yeah, like wow. 30,000 30, monthly listeners, and have for the past 12 months. So like they're doing their thing. Um, I they've been consistent too. It's not just about the views. They drop project after project, single after single. Um, I think they're originally from like the Binghamton, Vesto area. Um, I, I got a lot of mutual friends with them. I haven't got to meet up with them in person. I was planning a show for April 17th, and I had booked the dwellers. Uh, they had uh -huh. booked the dwellers. They had booked flights, and because of coronavirus, it got canceled. So That's shout tough. out to for holding their heads and understanding that we're going to get you back up here. Um, and watch out for that Cannon and Dwellers track because that's coming. I'm excited for that. Yeah, they're well, nice. And like you said, they're, they've they really had a following, a consistent following going for them since I checked them out. And, and I was kind of just waiting for this track because I've been waiting for something new from them to start connecting with them and working on promoting whatever they're working on. So this this was sweet, and it was it's a dope track. Uh, they've also got some merch uh, to go with the track, so if you're interested in that, make sure you check out their social media, Instagram, and purchase some of their merch.